Hello and welcome back to Focus Atlanta. Thank you so much for continuing to watch. We are continuing our story about the Boys and Girls Club of Metro Atlanta. And as promised, I'm here with Miss Precious Blaylock. In addition to Missy Dugan, thank you, Precious, for joining us. Thank you for having me. Now, I'm super excited to hear about all <laughs> of your plans. But let's start off with how long you've been a part of the Boys and Girls Club. I've been a part of the Boys and Girls Club since I was eight years old. So this is my 10th year anniversary. I was trying to get a party, but you know. <laughs> Would you say that you've made um, not only the people that you're in the club with, but you've made family and friends out of this experience? Absolutely. I was just telling um, Missy, Miss Missy, how um, I was going to bring some of my friends from the club to my graduation party wow. so they can teach games from very, cl camp. Very nice, very nice. Now, what is this t-shirt? What, what does that stand for? So it stands for mobilizing a difference in real life. And basically, it's a, a team-based um, curriculum where we um, well, we were able to implement things for our teens like um, anti-bullying, teen suicide, and really like create a foundation for teens everywhere on how they should run things in their club. Wow, and these are things that you could take along with you. Exactly. On to college. <laughs> Can we talk about college a little bit, Missy? Yes. <laughs> Tell me about it. Precious, okay. where are you going? I will be attending the Georgetown University <laughs> in the fall. That is phenomenal. And I hear that you are a Gates Millennial, is it called Millennial Scholar? Millennium, yes. That Thank is you. phenomenal. Thank Tell you. me about that experience. Where it, did you apply? It was extremely nerve-wracking to say <laughs> the least. Um, my counselors were getting on me since August, so getting your paperwork, yeah, getting their yeah. essays. So I had to write a total of eight essays wow. along with an extensive ap application um, where you had to write in all your community service, what the community service consists of, all your awards, what they consist of. And so getting recommendations, you had to have a nominator and a recommender. Wow. And there had to be those specific ones. Okay. And you had to get it right. Or, or, like at the last one, I had my nominator and um, recommender were mixed up. So someone had to do me a um, last minute recommender, wow. and it was crazy, but I got it in. <laughs> Those eight essays, and like God was on my side because Gates has never done this before. They extended the, le deadline, the deadline to 5 p.m. the next day, and it and was it well in. needed, exactly. And <laughs> see the fruits of your labor, right. it all came together. Now, would you say those type of things, um, would you say that the Boys and Girls Club helped you to accomplish those things. Absolutely. You know, do you think that you would have been able to do that without your experience and your growth in the Boys and Girls Club? The thing I love about Boys and Girls Club is that they kind of prepared me for everything that I do. Um, Boys and Girls Club was the first people who gave me opportunities. Like, um, I believe my first opportunity was going backpacking. Wow. And even like small things like, like that. that, it like sh showed me there's a bigger world out here and you can go get it if you just look for it. And so with those opportunities, I was able to go to Princeton last summer for seven weeks um, oh for another phenomenal program and things like that. They encouraged me to do that and then, and then they praised me after I did it so I'm just like okay I'm just doing stuff to get out of the house but no you're doing stuff that is phenomenal and making an impact absolutely and although precious is phenomenal <laughs> there are more precious out there um, Missy right. tell me a little bit about sure. the statistics like all or almost all of your students are college bound or, or going to some kind of post um, secondary tell mm -hmm. me about that. anyone who is involved in the college and career ready program we graduate 98% Ninety-eight percent from high school, and then on to some sort of post-secondary. So either college, the military, we um, certainly technical colleges, all of those types of partnerships that we can help develop to give our children a plan for their life. That is great. And speaking of the plan, what are we uh, majoring in at Georgetown? Have we decided? What we yes, I want to major in English so I can go to law school. But I have to get my doctor's first because you know Gates pays to, all the way to your doctorate degree. So after I get my doctor, I'll go to law school. Precious, <laughs> I'm all excited. <laughs> like this is just the beginning of everything for you. I mean, it, the sky is the limit now. And Thank you. you know, depending on what you, what you decide to focus in on your law career, we, you might be the next Supreme Court justice at some point. I say I'm going to be bigger than Oprah. I love it. That's my motto. Okay, then let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm really? so glad that you have the support of the Boys and Girls yes. Club to make that happen. So, okay, someone has, you know, again, we've all heard of the Boys and right. Girls Club, but perhaps you've never volunteered or we've never supported. Mm -hmm. um, what do you tell somebody about what this 
what the Boys and Girls Club pro provides for students? Mm -hmm. um, I, I talk to my teens mostly, so what I tell them is it's the best kept secret because all of them think that it's a place for kids and little kids. And I say, no, it's not. How do you think I get to do all the stuff I do? It's because of the Boys and Girls Club. And when I tell them that, they was like, you get to do that at the Boys and Girls Club? I said, yes, so come. And so um, I recruited some people, but you know, most of them are stuck in their ways. But, um, but I, I lead by the, like the fruits of my labor or whatever I do, and I say Boys and Girls Club after, and they're like, oh yeah, she told us that already. So they get tired <laughs> of hearing it, but it's like the best kept secret. Like it's everything you could ever imagine. That's what the Boys and Girls Club encompasses. Well, I am super proud of you, and I'm Thank super you. excited for all of the things that you're gonna bring. You're gonna be our homegrown hero. She's gonna come back to Atlanta <laughs> with all of these degrees right. and all these fantastic things. So it was good to meet you. Thank you. And thank you, Missy, thank for, you so for coming much. on and doing what you do, because um, you know, the Boys and Girls Club helps to mentor fantastic students like this, and we wouldn't know about them otherwise. Exactly. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. All right, guys, you have all the information that you need. Please take the opportunity to learn a little bit more about the Boys and Girls Club. We have a website right there for you. You, um, in case you want to, you know, help another student be as good as Precious is, um, <laughs> you could be a part of that if you take the time to learn a little bit more and support. We'll be right back with more Focus Atlanta. Stay tuned on Atlanta CW.